，去你丫的！眼前这个嚣张无比的韩国黄毛竟然扭屁股叉腰，表示中国选手打得太差，甚至还勾手指示意继续进攻，结果被中国小伙摁在地上展示中国力量。那眼前这名选手就是刚刚嘚瑟无比的韩国棒子赵南真。四十三场胜利，三十七次 KO 对手，是一个实打实的柔术高手。那本场比赛的中国选手就是被誉为摔跤奇才的姚洪刚，从小就干各种农活，练得浑身都是劲儿，进入拳坛也是展示出了惊人的天赋。那今天他就要让这个嘚瑟的韩国棒子付出代价。那好的，现在比赛已经正式开始，这场带给大家的是精彩的中韩对局，红色拳套，黑色短裤，就是中国猛将姚洪刚。另一边，蓝方选手白色短裤，哎呦，上来就被打倒的，这个就是韩国棒子赵南真。那之前我们见过嚣张的韩国选手啊，都是赛前说两句狠话，但是这个赵南真啊，竟然是在比赛中途扭屁股叉腰嘲讽中国选手啊，见过嚣张的，没见过这么嚣张的。所以说现在杨洪刚非常的气愤，上场之后直接就一点面子都没留，上场直接开打。那这一场，让我们期待一下姚洪刚会带来怎样精彩的表现哎呦，韩国棒子，这是什么打法？青蛙跳啊！这个跳膝没学明白，变成了一只癞蛤蟆。那这一下完全是被姚洪刚轻松挡住。现在顺势来到地面，赵南真又一次被压制了。啊，这场比赛可以说打得很难受，开场就被压制，中场还是被压制。那赛前介绍的时候，我们也是说过，赵南真是柔术高手。既然他是柔术高手，那地面战肯定是不虚。但是现在依旧被姚洪刚轻松的压制，啊，可见姚洪刚的实力有多么的强了。Great to have men with experience under their belt controlling these fights. Joe gets his elbow in the face of Yao. There's. How do you make a transition as a fighter from wrestling to BJJ? Is it easy for Hui Menez and the China top team to? Help you out with this transition. Well, I can tell you from my experience in Beijing, we were bringing in a lot of sandal fighters and trying to introduce the ground game to them, and it was always easier to take the wrestler and teach him how to strike. I'm sure the transition for 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 a grappler of any kind to BJJ is, is easier than it would be for someone from a striking discipline. For sure. 那现在时间还剩下不到两分钟。那也确实看得出来啊，赵南真也是根本不想打战力，因为战力他实在是太吃亏了。现在他处在上位，但是没有什么输出空间，但是把自己的腰子给了姚洪刚啊，这个位置看一下姚洪刚能否找到进攻的位置。两人在地面还是比较消耗体能的。现在赵南真改变身位，想要骑在姚洪刚的身上。Joe Namjoon struts around like a rock star, and that's because he is. Oh! Well, we all pass unsuccessful back inside the open guard of the master. Joe Namjoon plays the drums in the band, so that's where he learns the rock star attitude. Oh, firing elbows! Yao should really. See, he's got his feet caught. He should really push him away. Oh, now he's in the mat. All tables have turned. The Chinese fans have gone wild here inside. Beautiful. City of Dreams Casino is Yao alone, hammer fisted elbows. Yao is in trouble. 
I'm sorry, Joe is in trouble. Oh, it doesn't look like it. He's telling the crowd to bring it on. How can he mop the crowd while he's down in that position? <laughs> yeah, the expression on his face tells us a different story, though, Mike. For sure. 那现在还剩最后的不到四十秒了。第一回合的比赛基本上全程都是在地面，那这个位置杨洪刚也是比较主动处在上位，不过依旧是进攻空间有限呐、啊。I wonder if I wonder if Joe trains that. <laughs> Ooh, a nice technical up kick from Joe. A low kick from Yao. 好的，那现在第一回合比赛结束。那比赛结束也是让这个赵南真躺在地上的尴尬局面得以解脱。那第一回合杨洪刚所表现出来的实力确实是没有想到，本以为他拳法厉害，没想到啊，地面战也是非常强。那现在我们来到了第二回合。那刚刚休息的时候也是调整了一下状态，看一下第二回合姚洪刚会采取一个什么样的战术。Joe go for the takedowns, try to fight on the ground. I think maybe it's a trick in the second round. Maybe he'll fake takedowns and unload with stand up. I think Joe has. 那目前看来，姚洪刚比较主动，但是赵南真看起来可是非常害怕。一步步，哎呦，我们看，居然扭屁股，叉腰勾手。那姚洪刚踢出了一脚一记低扫啊！这个赵南真觉得你打得不行啊，确实是太嚣张了。好的，这一下姚洪刚直接下前抱摔，赵南真还没反应过来啊，身体就已经躺在地上了。这次又是赵南真处在下位，哦，但是这个拼命的挣扎呀，身体已经扭曲了一个比较奇怪的弧度啊，但是依旧没有放弃那现在赵南真躺在地上耍赖，姚洪刚是抓着脚踢屁股，啊，这个场面非常的有趣啊。我、哦、这个位置想要起身，但是姚洪刚直接给出一拳，赵南真又躺在地上了。Playing a bit of catch up with the points deduction, a bloody nose for his troubles, but certainly he's had a great fight here against the Korean Joe. Yeah, if he jumps to guard, he might look to finish his guillotine. Yeah, he's done a great job with 10 seconds to go, but is it enough? The crowd going crazy, willing him on for the last seconds of this fight. 好的，现在比赛结束，韩国棒子赵南真啊是被压得不行了，啊，虽然看到姚洪刚也是有些受伤，但是这个韩国棒子全程被压制，打的是更惨。那这场比赛姚洪刚也是让这个赵南真知道啊，什么才是真正的中国力量。那最后让我们恭喜姚洪刚获得了本场比赛的胜利。那观众朋友们，让我们下一期再见。